Yum, yum. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Hi, friends. Uh, I guess I'll save this snack for later so we can go on a Bible adventure. Friends, shake your hands high in the sky if you'll go with me. Woohoo! <laughs> friends, pretend to put on your adventure bags. <gasps> Wee! Hiya, Emily. Hiya, friends. Hi, Shine. We need a question to ask on our Bible adventure. I've got one. What problems are too big for God? Yowie zowie. Which picture passes will help us answer that? I'll give you some clues, Emily. Friends, you and I will be picture pass guessers together. <sighs> hey, something's wrong with that picture pass. There's nothing on it. But you still need it for your Bible adventure. Then let's catch it in our adventure bags. <laughs> Here's your next clue. You carry your lunch in it. Friends, which one do you think it is? I think you've got it. It's the lunchbox. Yum, yum. <laughs> wow, zowie. It matches my lunchbox. See? <laughs> it sure does. Friends, catch the lunchbox in your adventure bags. The last picture pass helps you see everything that's in the sky. Hmm, friends, which one is it? I think you're right. It's the telescope! <laughs> Catch it in your adventure bags! <sighs> Friends, count with me! One, two, three! Yep, they're all here! Let's zip our adventure bags together! Now, now it's, it's time, time to, to fly. fly! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> what problems are too big for God? Hmm. How are we going to answer that? Let's look in the Bible. The Bible is God's book for you. You can trust. It's right and true. <gasps> the Big Picnic. That's in the book of Mark, in the Bible. Let's see what it's about. <laughs> Jesus had finished teaching. Everyone was hungry. Send them away to buy food, his disciples said. But Jesus wanted to show the people that they could trust God. Why don't you feed them, Jesus asked. It would take a year's wages to buy bread for them all, his disciples cried. How much food do you have? asked Jesus. There is a boy here, said Andrew, who has five loaves of bread and two little fish. Jesus smiled. Perfect. Tell the people to sit down on the grass. So the people sat down all over the mountainside. Jesus thanked God for the bread and the fish. Then he broke them into pieces for his disciples to hand out. Jesus' disciples passed out bread and fish to the whole crowd. There were 5,000 men and lots of women and children, too. Everyone ate as much as they wanted. Afterwards, the disciples gathered up the leftovers. There were 12 baskets full from just five loaves and two fish. The people knew they could trust God to care for them. Whoa, that was a big problem. But it wasn't too big for God. He made that boy's little lunch turn into a big dinner. Yeah, that story makes me think God can do anything. So what problems are too big for God? Maybe Guy the Bible Guy can help? Oh, yeah. See ya, Shine. See ya, Emily. Come on. <laughs> C 
Come in. Hi, Guy. Hi, Emily. What are you finding out on your Bible adventure? Well, we're trying to find out what problems are too big for God. I know a Bible verse about that. <gasps> Friends, wiggle your ears if you're ready to learn a verse with me. I'm wiggling my ears. Are you wiggling yours? Okay, listen to what the Bible says. Jeremiah 32, 17. Oh, Lord, you made the heavens and earth. Nothing is too hard for you. <laughs> <laughs> Friends, say the verse with me. Jeremiah 32, 17. Jeremiah 32, 17. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. You made the heavens and earth. You made the heavens and earth. Nothing is too hard for you. Nothing is too hard for you. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, friends. Now say the whole verse with us. Jeremiah 32, 17. Oh, Lord, you made the heavens and earth. Nothing is too hard for you. <laughs> friends, great job. So, Emily. What problems are too big for God? Nothing is too big for God. <laughs> that reminds me of a picture pass. Friends, which picture pass has nothing on it? <laughs> Way to go. It's the picture pass about nothing. <laughs> Cause nothing is too hard for God. <laughs> God's power is way bigger than any of our problems. We can trust him to take care of us. <laughs> <laughs> we have a big, strong, powerful God to take care of us. <laughs> Bye, Guy. Bye, Emily. Bye, friends. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> our God's so strong. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> ha ha! Too fast for you, raindrops! Ow! Oh! Ugh. Ow! I guess my mom was right about those raindrops! Blinky, be careful. It's about to storm, you know. <gasps> it's gonna storm? Don't worry, Blinky. God made storms to send us rain for the grass, the trees, and the flowers, like yours truly. But storms are not good for me. When raindrops hit me, it hurts. Ah, and the storm has lots of raindrops. I can't dodge them all. Oh my, that's a big problem. No problems too big for God. Pray and trust God. He'll take care of you and show you what to do. Friends, will you pray with us? God, I'm super duper afraid I'll get hurt in a storm. Please show me what I need to do and keep me safe. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Now we'll help you and trust God to take care of the rest. You'll feel better if you stay right here next to me. And I'll cover you with my petals. Ah! Oh. oh no, my wig's still sticking out. I'm gonna get hurt. Blinky, trust God. He loves you and he'll take care of you. Okay. Ah! Whoa. Wait, did I make it? Yeah, God showed us how to help you and he sent the wind to blow that raindrop away from you. Wow. God took care of you with his big, strong power. God, no problem is too big for you. Thanks for taking care of me. Hey friends, 
Our Bible verse tells us that nothing is too hard for our big, strong, powerful God. Say the verse with me. Jeremiah 32, 17. Oh, Lord, you made the heavens and earth. Nothing is too hard for you. <laughs> when you trust and follow Jesus, nothing needs to worry you. Do you remember the answer to our question? What problems are too big for God? <laughs> Great! Say it with me, friends. Nothing is too hard for God. <laughs> Do you hear that music? Mr. Music's singing studio must be close. Come on, let's go. Oh, hi, Emily. Oh, hi, friends. Hi, Mr. Music. Do you know what problems are too big for God? <gasps> Nothing is too big for God. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know what to do when I have a problem. When you feel that way, you can pray. Then think about lunch. <laughs> lunch? Oh, wait! That reminds me of a picture pass. Friends, which picture pass do you carry your lunch in? That's right, friends. It's the lunch box. Yum, yum. That boy gave his little lunch when there was a big problem. Jesus prayed over it, and God used that little lunch and his big, strong power to feed lots. And lots. And, and lots, lots of people. people. When you see a problem, give what you can to help. And then trust God's big, strong power to take care of the rest. I know a song about God's big, strong power. Friends, clap your hands together if you'd like to sing a song with me. I'm clapping my hands. Are you clapping yours? Okay, friends. We're going to start with the part where we sing about God's big, strong power. Oh. My God, my God is big. My God is big and strong and powerful. My God, my God is big. My God is big and strong and powerful. <laughs> Isn't that fun? Yeah. Let's sing the whole song. I can try, I'll do my very best, but only God can take care of the rest. Oh, I can trust, God will take care of me, cause nothing is too hard for God. My God, my God is big, my God is big and strong and powerful, my God. My God is big, my God is big and strong and powerful. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I can try, I'll do my very best, but only God can take care of the rest. Oh, I can trust, God will take care of me, cause nothing is too hard for God. My God! My God is big, my God is big and strong and powerful. My God, my God is big, my God is big and strong and powerful. My God is big and strong and powerful. My God is big and strong and powerful. <laughs> Yeah. Now stand to your feet to worship God with music, singing, and dancing. My Jesus knows my name When I'm sleeping or awake No matter what I do He'll never leave His words are true I tell Him what I love I tell him when I'm scared I tell him everything Jesus is always there I'm spinning round, I'm running free I'm having fun, yeah, with my king No one is like you, Jesus No one like you On really bad days you are strong When it's good you laugh along My best friend, my BFF Jesus, that's you my Jesus 
Jesus knows my name When I'm sleeping or awake No matter what I do He'll never leave His words are true I tell Him what I love I tell Him when I am scared I tell Him everything Jesus is always there to the question, what problems are too big for God? Yup, yup, yuppers. Nothing is too big for God. <laughs> what Bible verse did Guy teach you? Friends, say it with me for shine. Jeremiah 32, 17. Oh, Lord, you made the heavens and earth. Nothing is too hard for you. <laughs> wow! 
God is amazing. What did you find out about the picture passes? Nothing. It's too hard for God. None of our problems are too big for God's big, strong power. And the lunchbox, yum, yum, reminds us to be like the little boy from our Bible story. How are you going to do that? When there's a problem, I'm going to pray and give what I can to help. <laughs> Wee! And God can use his big, strong power to take care of the rest. <laughs> but how does the telescope help me? What does it help you see? The moon, the stars, pretty much everything in the sky. Who made all of that? Our Bible verse says God did. <gasps> oh, yeah, God made everything. <laughs> <laughs> That's why nothing's too hard for him. <laughs> <laughs> Wee! Let's pray for our friends. Okay. Friends, bow your heads and close your eyes. We're going to talk to God together. Dear God, thank you for loving us and taking care of all of our problems. We trust that nothing is too hard for you. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. <gasps> Pickles and picnics! It's time to go. We'll see you next time for another Bible adventure. Bye-bye, friends. <laughs> <laughs>